My name is China. I'm a junior, and I want to be a nurse when I grow up. I feel like St. Joan and Tita can transform somebody like me because I'm a bit shy. So St. Joan and Tita really pushes for confidence, like to be confident in yourself and to take risks. China's really started to find her voice. And to me, that's amazing because that's part of our mission. It's part of what we want to do is help students find their voice, find their passion. For me, it's an incredible parallel to when I found my own voice as a student in high school. And seeing her find that voice, knowing that when she heads off to college a little bit over a year from now, makes me really grateful to have seen that growth in her and feel blessed to have been a part of China's story. I chose to come back to work at St. John Antita High School because the story of our girls is the story of my own life. I came to St. John Antita High School as a very quiet, shy young lady. The scholarships that I received to come to St. John Antita High School transformed my life. Scholarship was so important to me as a young woman, but I think is even more important in today's world. China's family has always been incredibly supportive of her education. Many people wouldn't know about some of the challenges that China has faced. When I was in eighth grade in the year of 2016, I lost my dad. He will always say nothing comes for free. So I feel like that my life is really reflecting that idea of working hard and earning what you get. As a single parent, China's mother has faced a lot of obstacles and challenges to make sure that her children are getting what she thinks is best for each of them individually. China's mother, she had an opportunity to take a job in Arizona. She knew that long term, this job and this opportunity would be the right fit for her family. She also knew that she didn't want to take China out of St. John Antita. China has a wonderful aunt that she lives with here in Milwaukee now, and her mother lives in Arizona. I do feel love from the community. I feel like me having to go through boss and my mom being far away, the school has helped me because the teachers and the students go above and beyond to give me support. I am most grateful for the Sisters of Charity that many years ago created a mission that is easy to support and a mission that is easy to love. The day the Sisters of Charity founded St. Joan Antita High School, Making a Catholic education affordable for young women has been at the core of what we've done. When we became the All Girls International Baccalaureate High School, it just gave that recognition that we have a commitment to young women who want to change the world, whether it's globally or in Milwaukee. My life has been changed since coming to St. John and Tita because they really challenge you to do your best. So you can take higher level science classes like biology or chemistry. And in my case, I want to be a nurse, so I decided to take IB Bio. Everyone who supports the young women of St. John and Tita High School, they're supporting a life that's going to make an impact in our world, in our community. Someone did that for me when I was a high school student. And the fact that people continue to do that for these young women every day just humbles me. It humbles me that there are so many people that rally around and support our young women because they deserve it. And I'm happy that we get to be a part of the story for China, for her classmates, and for all the young women who have come through our doors before them and will come through our doors after. I want to thank everybody who makes St. John and Tita High School possible. St. John and Tita High School is preparing me to transform tomorrow.